Here is the Panasonic HCX900 camcorder. And I want to take this with me into the city because there is something special going on that I want to record. And it's only today, so I am in kind of a hurry. The problem is today it's very windy and I do need the sound to go along with the video. So I don't want to have any excessive wind noise in the audio. But given that I really only have a few hours left to, uh, to do this all, uh, I cannot go and buy some proper materials to fabricate some sort of a windscreen. So here is the really quick and really dirty variant. I found this, uh, this microfiber cleaning rag. And yes, it is a dirty solution because this has already been used, but it, it has been washed. So it's not filthy. It just doesn't look very pretty anymore. This is a microfiber, as I already said, and it seems to do a pretty good job at blocking out wind noise. Let me, uh, let me simulate this to you. I'm now going to simulate some wind, and while I'm doing that, I'm going to slide the microfiber cleaning rag over the microphones, and you can hear for yourselves how much of an effect there is. Okay, so as you can clearly hear, it's not perfect, but for what it is, it's pretty good. The microfiber cloth is made up from two layers of microfiber material, so I cut out this uh, square and I'm going to repeat my test to see if uh, just this uh, one single layer is uh, sufficient. Okay, there is definitely a lot more leaking through, but I think it's better than nothing, so let me continue. Okay, turns out this is not going all too quick after all. I realize I don't have any double-sided sticky tape, so I just had to run out and get some. So I now have some double-sided sticky tape all around the microphone. It doesn't look pretty, but it ought to work. In the store, I also found this cleaning rack, which I thought was going to be so much nicer than that old thing that I have. But unfortunately, that's not the case. Number one, as you can see, as you cut it, the material is falling apart completely. And as you can also see, it's kind of see-through. So that's not going to block the wind at all. So I'll have to uh, stick with this thing here. The microfiber has been installed on the camcorder, and yes, this does look absolutely terrible. And I will redo this eventually when I have some better material. I mean, well, this stuff, that color would have looked even worse. So let's test this for yet another time. So you can definitely still hear that there is wind, but it's not nearly as bad as it was without the microfiber in place. Now, I found out that throughout all this time, the electronic wind filter of the camcorder was on. So yeah, obviously that doesn't do a thing. But for one final test, I'm now going to turn it off. So, I will have to admit, the electronic wind filter does do something, but not much. There is an audible difference. So, I guess what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the electronic wind filter back on in addition to the microfiber cloth on the camcorder. So, that's it. The quick and dirty windscreen has been finished and successfully tested. And after all this, 
not only has the wind died down, no, it also started to rain. So, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching.